Are you a content creator who doesn't want to spend extra money on video editing software? Or you just want to learn how to use the new Canva video editor with the new function that you will love? You can edit videos without spending a single penny. Let me show you how. So to open Canva, go at your search bar and type for canva.com. To start the creation of a video, the first thing you need to do is click here on videos. And here you can choose the resolution of the video. So a regular video size, a mobile video, a Facebook video, Instagram reel, TikTok video, etc. You have many more types of videos right here. I'm gonna use the regular video template. Click on it. The first thing I'm gonna do is add media here to Canva to start editing my video. Go here at uploads, click on upload file or you can drag media here. I prefer to drag the media. So I will open my file explorer and here on downloads I will select three different videos of city shots. So I drag them here and wait for this processing. Now the process is done, we'll start the editing of our video. The first shot I want is this, so I click on it. Now you can see that my shot was added to the video. I'll go here and upscale it to fit on the video size. That's it. Dragging this, you can see how your video will look. Or you can just tap the play button right here too. Clicking here, you can change the zoom of your preview. And if you want to zoom in or zoom out your timeline, click here and now you can do it. So I'll play my video and we'll see at what moment I want to cut it. Let's go. I think here is already good. So I go here and drag this right here. This is good. Now, I choose the other video. I'll choose this as the second one. So I'll add a page and I'm going to click on this video. Drag it again to fit on the video format. And let's see how it is. That's good. Here it's fine, so I'll cut it again. And let's add and let's add the last video, clicking it, clicking here on add page and choose the last video. Resize it again. Let's play it again to see when I want to cut. I think that's good. So I go here at the end and I'll drag this until I find my trimmer. That's it. I want to add a transition in the middle of the video. So I go here at my mouse and I put it over between the two clips. And I go here and I'll add transition. Put the mouse over the transition to see how it will look. I will choose the solve. Here you can change the duration of the transition. Now I'm gonna go and add another transition. I will add a slide. And here you can choose the direction of the slide. So I want to slide up. And I will make this transition more quicker. So I'm gonna change to 0.3. Now let's say I want to add a filter to my video. I want to add in the first video. I go here. Click on it. Now I click on edit video and here you can change the filters. If you have Canva Pro, you can remove the background too. Click here to see all filters. I will choose epic. Let's see how it is. I think that's great. I will do on the other clips. Go again on edit video. Go back and now click on adjust. Here you can change the white balance, the brightness, the contrast, many other things. The color, you can add a texture. I will add some vignettes. You can see that when you select the video, 
you have a couple options up here. You can crop the video, you can flip it horizontally or vertically. You can animate it. You can change the position too. You can change the ratio. You can change the transparency. You can change the volume of the video. Click in here, you can mute it. You can make notes right here too. So let's say I want to add some text to the first clip. I'm going here at text and I'm going to choose a preset. Let's go with this. I didn't like the color of the text, so I'll select it. The configuration of your text is just like the regular Canva. I will prefer to use a black text, so I'm changing it. And I'll change this text to welcome to New York, the city of the opportunity. And I'm going to change this side to my text fit better. Now I'm going to drag this here and we use an effect. Let's do a neo. No, let's do outline. I think that's good. Let's change the color of our outline to white. Add some thickness. I think I go with shadow. Yeah, that's better. And I'm going to animate it. Let's do... I will choose the baseline. Here you can choose if you're gonna animate on enter, on exit, on both. I just want it on enter. You can change the speed and the direction if you are a pro user. I want to add an element. So I go here at elements and I'll choose this. You can see that is on my video now. I'm gonna add some text again. I will animate this too. And on the last clip of the video, I will add a subscribe button. So I go here and choose it the subscribe button. I will change the sign. And I put it right here in the middle. That's good. At this option, you can draw on your video. So this is an option too. I will add a heart. Finally, to export your video, click here on the share button. Now you can edit the people that have access to the video or you can make a collaboration link. I'm just gonna download it. Click in here on download. Choose the file type. I'll go with MP4. Choose which pages you want to be on your exported video and click here on download. Wait for the downloading process. And that's it. My video is here. Let's open to see how it is. If you had any doubt about the process, Want to make a compliment or a suggestion? Please comment below. If the video helped you, leave a like on the video and subscribe to help us too. Bye!